Yeah, I mean, anytime you can score 90 points, it makes winning a little bit easier. Um, um, you know, we we uh, we knew going into the game that uh, their their personnel at the rim, uh, because of depth and without the young man Brown, was it Brown or Thomas, the one that got hurt? No, 13. Oh God, Cleveon Brown, and without him in there, I think he's competing to be their leading shot blocker in school history or something like that. If I'm not mistaken, I could be wrong. I thought I read that, uh, but they're they're thin. At the front line, and they're all freshmen. Uh, so, uh, being aggressive at the rim was part of our game plan going in, and um, I, I thought we we did a better job of that in the second half than we did early in the game. Um, uh, but, uh, um, and I think that wore them down to a certain extent. I could be wrong, but uh, that that's kind of the impression I had. Frank, how encouraging is it to see, you know, kind of different guys really stepping up every night? Tonight it was McCreary. Uh, Justin had a double-double. Just how encouraging is it to see all that depth really paying off with a, a different way to hurt teams every night? Yeah, I mean, Justin's been – Justin's a rock. I mean, he he uh, uh, he plays with a desire, with an enthusiasm and energy. That's every day in practice. What you guys see there, that's what he does every single day in practice. And – and I'm really happy that he's starting to gain tremendous confidence in himself. And because um, early in the year he was, I don't know why he was doubting in himself, and it wasn't because of the leg; he was just doubting in himself. And um, but that's that's why you stick with guys that are committed, and and he's committed. Jalen's another wonderful young man um, because of the fact that, like I just said about Vanderbilt, they play a little smaller. Uh, I think. Uh, Jalen wasn't swallowed up with size at the rim, and they're freshmen just like him. So um, he he uh, he didn't have to deal with uh, Anthony and 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 uh, uh, Macklemore and uh, uh, none up here from Wiley. He didn't have to deal with guys like that, and that's that's the challenge when you're a freshman is that you end up dealing with those kind of guys. And uh, but today he kind of dealt with guys that are his age and and. Um, so, and, and he's been great. He, he's both feet in to what we try to do and what we ask him to do. He's, he's uh, um, uh, you know, um, he's, he's, I'm excited about him uh, and what he's going to become in his time here. Frank, uh, Justin said uh, earlier that part of the reason you guys are winning some games is because at practice, you, they're making the most of their opportunities to practice mm -hmm. and working hard. I wanted to get your perspective, if that's what you're seeing. Out of these guys, no doubt, and and I don't mean to keep beating on the same drum, but it, it, now with Cousinard, uh in the lineup, it's giving uh, a voice from the guard spot. It's giving courage from the guard spot, which is no surprise. It's helping Justin play better. Um, Keisha, I, I mean, we we got to figure out a way to keep our good players on the court. You know, we we lose to Florida, we got no Jermaine. We lose at Auburn, we got no Key. You know, Keyshawn, Keyshawn, he's making some mistakes, but he's trying to make basketball plays. I, but his commitment to what we're trying to do, um, his voice, like Keyshawn won't say boo last year. Now he's like talking, trying to help his team, trying to stay positive. Uh, and, and now he's trying to make basket. Last year he was just a dunker. Let's just get on the open court if we can and go dunk. Now he's making basketball plays. He's trying to know when to drive. Like he made a great play today he couldn't make last year uh, where he made that pass to Alonzo. The game had already separated, but still, that's the right play to make. And um, uh, uh, it's Jermaine's voice, is his, he doesn't shut up. You know, and that's been the one thing that's been really frustrating with this team is that we're really quiet. Um, and, uh, I, you know, I guess I should have probably tried to inject Jermaine at the point earlier in the year. Let's let's say it this way: uh, When my children get their driver's license, I don't just give them the keys to the car and say good luck. I'm gonna ride shotgun for a little while. And with Jermaine, I've been riding shotgun for a little while, but I thought it was time to, to finally put him in there, uh, so so he can give us some courage and a voice and 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 uplift the other guys.